Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a program called Tarot Your Love Story for April 2018 and that's for you coming from Aries. So let me shuffle my Kabbalistic Tarot cards and the first card that I pull, I like to pull it for the month of April and I'm going to pull two cards at the same time and uh, let you know that this month is divided into two the first card and the second card and when I look at the first card it's a very lucky card which means that you are able to find the romance if you want and it's going to be a very good romance with plenty of love I see the signs of Venus and Neptune and the Moon on this first card which is for your first 15 days or so and this first card shows a plenty of attraction for you so dress well and look good and be out and about and you will be able to attract somebody's attention or the attention of somebody you have been wanting to attract for some time it's a card that shows that in your area of finding a romance you can be very lucky and in the area of an ongoing romance you will also be very lucky and so the chances of you finding happiness in the romance area is very very strong in the first 15 days now regarding your marriage areas they are also going very well and these marriage areas can bring plenty of help for you in the sense that there's a lot of bonding with this card there's a lot of to and fro energies going and so I see this first 15 days as very magical in improving the romance, improving the marriage and finding a new romance. It's a card that brings plenty of promise, meaning that there is a lot of hope for whatever happens in this first 15 days, a lot of hope for quite a time of happiness. Let's go to the second card. Now, the second card which I've pulled for the last 15 days is going to be a very difficult one and as I compare it to the first one it's all reversals it shows that either you or your romance partner can be very dominating and therefore very stubborn and therefore not ready to negotiate it also shows conflict with you and your ongoing romance partner so if you value the romance you'll have to be cautious that it can be stretched to breaking point in the last 15 days or so of April. Compared to the first card, there is a lot of differences here. And my worry is that it can be stretched to breaking point, your romance that's ongoing. And if you find the new romance in the last 15 days, I'd be very careful. Otherwise, you're going to have a lot of disturbances in the new romance. And it says that you can come under the control of a romance partner either the ongoing or a new romance and so you have to be careful that either in the form of dependency or either in the form of your freedom you can be in trouble in your area of romance and if the new romance that you find will also come with complications in the last 15 days of April in marriage areas well it says you are locked in you are locked in meaning that you have nowhere to go and so if you have nowhere to go you might as well make it happy where you are so in your marriage area in the last 15 days you want to be friendly you want to be appreciative you want to be supportive and all the temperature that's rising will simmer down and it'll become cool and you'll be able to get the control over your marriage area although it may be bubbling at times with anger. You are listening to me, so remember about that. Now, I want to talk to you about your lucky dates and your lucky dates for Aries. The dates I've chosen are the 9th, the 18th and the 27th. And the 9th, 18th and 27th have many cluster of planets that are all going to help you in all areas of your life. But this is a program called Your Love Story. So we'll stick to the love story area. And it says this cluster of planets can help you find the romance on this 9th, 18th and 27th or bring solutions in romance or marriage areas. So use the 9th, 18th, 27th to bond 
with the people you love or to go hunting for a romance and you're going to be very lucky in your own way. I want to give you your lucky ages for you coming from Aries and your lucky ages would be the ages of 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72 or even 81. And if you happen to be these ages in the month of April and if you come from Aries, then you're going to be one very lucky person in the month of April. And you will be able to override any difficulties and bring things under your control. You will be able to just get the romance you want. You will be able to find the solutions to make your ongoing romance and marriage very, very happy. I want to talk to you about your colours. And the colour I have chosen based on these cards is the colour red. Kabbalistic cards give a lot of zodiac signs and planet signs, so that guides me. And I like the colour red for you coming from Aries. And so wear plenty of red undergarments, top garments, and these are going to help you a great, great deal. Let's now talk about a secret desire. It could be a past contact. It could be somebody you're longing for attachment to. And in this month of April, the, the zodiac sign Pisces is very active because the signs are also here. <coughs> And so that's going to help you. Pisces will produce the person of your secret longings. So remember that. And I want to talk to you about some zodiac sign that might bring trouble for you. And looking at this card, what's inverted upside down is the planet Mars. So I worry that somebody from Scorpio could create problems for you in your marriage or in your romance or if you're a romance partner, new one that comes who is from Scorpio, be a bit careful. And if your marriage partner or ongoing romance partner is from Scorpio, be careful. <coughs> so be very cautious of that. Well, that's my news for you for the month of April. I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50.50 for a 90-minute Skype session. And during these 90 minutes, I will cover all areas of your life, not only your love story. <coughs> and I'll produce plenty of solutions for you as well in all areas of your life. I'll cover your next seven or eight or nine years. So that'll cost you USD 50, five zero. So go to Facebook, go to Skype, leave me a message and let's get down to it. Until then, thank you and good luck.